Namaste. Good morning, Taurus. Thank you for clicking on my video. Um, please like, share, subscribe, all that jizz, jazz. Thank you. Um, where are we? Where are we? Where are we? I'm just going to pull. I'm feeling like, Taurus, that you are ready to make a move. I feel like this something you guys want to charge towards. Yeah, look. <laughs> <laughs> what are you guys charging towards, Taurus? Could be dealing with a Scorpio. So you got the Eight of Cups. Maybe you're leaving a situation. Are you leaving a situation, leaving a Scorpio? Or charging towards a Scorpio? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, there's a lot of movement. Knight of Swords, the Chariot. We're dealing with Cancer. Um, Air Signs, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Can we dealing with all the signs? <laughs> they're, they're all here. <laughs> what messages? What messages have we got from that? Angels. Romance retreat. Are you chasing romance? Or are you guys retreating? You guys could be retreating away. Have you go, are you going on a retreat this weekend? Or are you going away without someone? I feel like you could be going away without someone. Someone's been, someone, someone's feeling left out. Someone's feeling left out. Left out, left out of, left out in the cold. I don't know, I haven't left out in the cold car there, but. Yeah, I feel like someone needs to meditate. Retreat and meditate. Taurus, if there's a situation, it could be work, family. I feel like this is, I feel like this is family. You're dealing with family. We're connecting with the Taurus that's going through some family stuff. Um, they're telling me that you need to look at this from a place of heart and don't be too, don't be too um, quick to judge. Okay, don't be too quick to judge. Don't be quick. Don't be too quick to judge and. Um, Take your time, be patient, don't rush. I feel like you guys might be rushing. Isabella, can we talk to Isabella? Yes, the timing is right for this new venture. A happy outcome follows your positive expectations. Yes. Okay, look at this, all this travel. Someone could be traveling into you guys with a message. Look at this. Could be a love interest coming towards you. Isabella. That's a pretty name. You, Yvonne, you have a special bond with animals. Your pets on earth and in heaven are watched over by angels. Uh, you might, you might have, I feel like you hit this, who I'm connecting with has kitten, cat. Or well, you've lost the cat. If you've lost, oh, if you've lost the pet. I've, I've lost pets. It's so fucking. It's so hard to deal with. If you've lost an animal or a pet recently, I'm sorry. Just know that they've been watched over. You're at the end of a cycle in your life. Yeah. So they the, someone has lost an animal recently. Call upon your angels to comfort you and guide you to your next step. Happiness awaits you now. Aww. I'm sorry, Carissa, Isabella, you've won. <laughs> uh -uh. I've seen uh -uh. Oh, this just got sad. Sorry, guys. Chantel, new romance is imminent, either with a newcomer or through reignited passion in your existence relationship. Be able to giving and receiving love. 
Oh, maybe just I feel like this is someone that wants to get a new animal, a new pet. Yeah, go on. Don't be. Don't feel sad for like. It's even like you know how people lose a loved one. They lose a loved one and then they'll never they'll never remarry or anything again for the whole life because they were just dedicated to that one person. Like people can get that like that with animals too. Francesca, what do you desire right now? Visualize it and it will come about. Negative, negativity will block your progress. Be open to giving and receiving love. Yeah, it's okay to move on. Anyone who's lost a, a, someone, a lover, even a lover that's passed over, you know, like, it's okay to move on. It's okay to love again. You know, you've got to you've got to let that person go because the more we hold on to them, what people don't understand is that when we hold on to the that person that's passed over, we don't live, we don't get the they don't we don't give them the chance to move on, so they can get back into the cycle of life again. So we 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 can hold instead of letting them go and letting them come back into this earth again as a new as a new a new person then we're holding like we're holding them back from ascending you know like it's sad it's really sad you know like i don't know if i if connecting with anyone that's lost someone that you know like they get real 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 down and out sometimes where you just like you, you just you just feel like crying because you miss that person so much you know, and then if you're constantly like that, you're holding on to that thought of them, which is keeping them here, you know? If that makes sense, it probably just sounded really whack. <laughs> Akasha, you are a spiritual teacher. You have the ability to counsel others and keep them awake in their spiritual gifts and divine life mission. Yeah. Instead of holding on to the, you know, like, there's a saying I learnt last year. Um, it's um, what was it? It's better to be. Um, it's better it happened, and to have lost it than it to have never happened. Oh, what was it? no? Better to have loved. Them. No, I can't even remember. Wow, I just fucking joshed that up, didn't I? Didn't I? <clears throat> Sorry, Torres. First reading of the morning. I'm still waking up. But. Hope we're doing well. Hope we're doing well. Let's see. For anyone who's got questions about love. Children, your love life has been affected by children. You got children and uh, they feel like a burden, maybe? Don't, don't ever, don't ever do that. You know, like, when we have children, we can, with something, you know, with something that I even had to learn, we've got to commit to them. That's, that's you know, we've got to raise them. Faithfulness retreat. Yeah, okay, we've got retreat twice here now. We've got retreat twice here now. Feel like you're getting, you need to get away with someone. Drop the kids off at mum and dad's and go and get away for the weekend. <laughs> Maybe that's what needs to be done. The kids will be all right, mum and dad's, trust me. So if mum and dad will take them, yeah, you need to reconnect. You need to reconnect. You need to reconnect. There's romance here. There's romance. Love. There is love. There is love with this person. Yeah, because there's, there's, there is new romance. To be connecting with a Chantal, a Caressa, Yvonne, Francesca. 
Isabella. You deserve love. Yes, you are lovable. Yeah, you are. Taurus, you guys are so... I, my, my baby mama is a Taurus, you know? She is... She is a beautiful person. A beautiful, beautiful person. I was just an asshole. Yeah, release X. Release X. Okay, for some of you, there, there, you've got there is a person that needs to be released. It could be this cancer, could be releasing this cancerian, uh, could be. It could be, could be Libra. I'm, I'm getting Libra, Gemini, maybe. Air and Earth don't mix, hey. Neutral, is it? Air and Earth, yeah, neutral. Maybe there's, yeah, there's, a, even releasing X, so the time has come to clear your energy. So even releasing X is just like, it might not be just your last one. Think about your last 10 Xs. Now you might be still holding on to that, that sort of energy. Yeah, trust. The situation calling is calling for you to have faith. Have faith. When we can release our exes, like honestly, like can anyone honestly say they've had a good breakup? Ever. Ever. Engagement. Someone's getting married. Possibly. Retreat. I'm getting this, I'm connecting. Yeah, there's someone here. There's, there is a lot of romance here for someone. Someone's falling in love. Someone is falling in love. Are you falling in love, Taurus? You deserve it, look. You deserve love. We all do. We all do. We all deserve love, guys, honestly. <coughs> I'm gonna get chakra. What does Taurus need to clear in their chakra? What messages do they need for chakras? Okay, let's turn me to stop here. Fourth chakra, heart chakra, radiate warmth and sincerity. Yeah, I feel like Taurus. I I am open to sharing, accepting, communicating, and connecting with others as I focus on this moment, not the past or the future. This moment, right here, right now. A smile, a kind-hearted way of speaking or a hug goes a long way towards uplifting others. Oh my God, I say that all the time. Like even a thank you, a thank you will fucking take you, will take, will take you so far. Like you, you don't realize it. I offer care and support where I can without rescuing. I nurture and respect my relationships. That's a real, like these chakra cards are so fucking cool. The messages they have are so like, <laughs> they go straight through you. They go straight through you, the messages, they do. It's like, wow, yes, yes. It almost inspires you instantly. If you read one of them cards, you're inspired, boom, straight away. Taurus. Love yourself. Chantal, Francesca, Caressa. Trust. Trust and love. Um, releasing exes. I feel like this is just this is just a nice like move forward, Taurus. You guys are moving forward. You guys are lovable. You need to you deserve love. Trust and deserving love. Um, some of you guys, if you've got kids, you just need to get away for the weekend. This weekend, get away. You and your partner, go away. Dirty weekend away. And if you've lost an animal recently, I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah someone's, someone's lost an animal. I'm very sorry. That animal is being watched over, okay? The animal is being watched over and they want you to get a new pet. They want you to get a new pet, okay? Aww. 
Mm, I'm gonna go before I start crying. <laughs> Taurus, I love you guys so much. Um, please like, share, subscribe. Subscribe. All my watchers are not even my subscribers. What's going on? What's going on? Just subscribe. I don't care if you don't watch me ever again. Just subscribe. <laughs> please. Thank you. Love you so much. I'll see you in the next video, Taurus. Um, stay real, stay humble, stay blessed, and stay true to you. Love you, bye.